Hello, everyone. In this video we will discuss how to create and prepare an ER diagram for Health Center Patient Information System. Please don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell to receive free updates. The project entitled Health Center Patient Information System is a database-driven application that manages the records of patient profile. The said project will be installed in the Health Center, City and Barangay. Core feature includes the patient personal profile, consultation module and patient medical history. The first step in the development of the Health Center Patient Information System is to prepare the ER diagram that will serve as the basis later on in the creation of the actual database. We will follow the three basic rules in creating the ER diagram. 1. Identify all the entities. 2. Identify the relationship between entities and 3. Add meaningful attributes to our entities. Step 1. Identify all entities. Entity is represented by the rectangle shape. The entity will be our database table of health center patient information system later on. 1. User 2. User log 3. Activities 4. Illness information 5. Illness occurrence record 6. Medicine 7. Medicine dispense 8. Consultation 9. Resident 10. Poor Oak. After we have specified our entities, it is time now to connect or establish a relationship among the entities. 1. The user's record slash encodes the list of activities of the health center, one to many relationship. 2. The user's record slash encodes the list of diseases and their information, one to many relationship. 3. The user's record slash encodes the list of medicines in their inventory, one to many relationship. 4. The user's record slash encodes the resident's personal profile for registration purposes, one to many relationship. 5. The user's record slash encodes the list of poor oak in the barangay, one to many relationship. 6. The users process the consultation record of the resident, one to many relationship. 7. The system also records the dispensing of medicines, one to many relationship. 8. Every activity of the user in the system will be recorded in the user log, one to many relationship. 9. A resident seeks for consultation, one to one relationship. 10. Consultation includes dispersal of medicine record, one to many relationship. The last part of the ERD process is to add attributes to our entities. User entity has the following attributes. ID-primary key represented with underline. Username. Password. Complete name. Contact. Address. Designation. Status. User log. Log ID-primary key represented with underline. User ID-foreign key. Login time. Logout time. Date. Activities, activity ID-primary key represented with underline. Name. Description. Date. Date encoded. Encoded by, foreign key. Illness information. Illness ID-primary key represented with underline. Name. Symptoms. Date encoded encoded by. Illness occurrence record. ID-primary key represented with underline. Illness ID foreign key consultation ID foreign key medicine medicine ID primary key represented with underline name generic name purpose date encoded encoded by foreign key medicine dispense ID primary key represented with underline consultation ID foreign key medicine ID foreign key patient ID foreign key quantity date encoded encoded by foreign key consultation consultation ID primary key represented with underline date of consultation patient ID foreign key weight temperature blood pressure pressure referred to prescription encoded by foreign key resident resident id dash primary key represented with underline first name middle name last name age gender poor oak id dash foreign key date of birth status nationality occupation date encoded encoded by foreign key poor oak poor oak id dash primary key represented with underline name date encoded foreign key encoded by entity relationship diagrams illustrate the relationships between entities in a database this can be helpful in understanding how the data is organized and how it can be accessed. Additionally, ER diagrams can help in designing and creating a database. Finally, ER diagrams can be used for data analysis and reporting. Entity, a thing or concept that is represented in a database by a row in a table. Entity relationship, the association between entities in a database. ER diagram, a type of entity relationship diagram that shows the relationships between tables and columns in a database. 
the ER diagram designed for health center patient information system will be a great help and source of information in the next stage of the project which will be the actual database design. Thank you for watching. For more free capstone projects ideas and resources, please subscribe and click the notification bell to receive free updates on our channel, you may also reach us on our Facebook page and website.